Well, hello, beauty lovers. I have some Lolly products. These are have been my go-to holy grail skincare products, and I need to get unready. I have a face full of makeup, and I thought I would come on and share with you guys how I use these products to get unready. So here we go. Have, is, have you, any of you ever heard of any of these? I hope that my camera focuses. I have the brulees, the date nut, <clears throat> date nut brulee. if I can do this. Nope, my camera doesn't want to do it. So this is the Lolly Date Nut Brulee. I also have the Chia Carrot Brulee. I love this. I use this as a, a sleeping mask and we'll get there. I have my Holy 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 Grail product. Love this, the Waters Cleanse and Tone Chamomile Lavender. I use this to take off my makeup every night. This does awesome for taking off the leftover liner, the mascara that when you wash your face in the shower and you come out and you still have all the the, the black. Hello, unsweetie. How are you, Stephanie? Thank you for coming in. I was going to do a quick un get unready with me featuring Lolly Beauty products that my camera doesn't want to focus on the the label. Amy, hello! Oh, I'm so excited I decided to do this. I wasn't sure if I was going to do this because this always takes more time than just taking off your makeup. So I'm going to go through my Lolly Beauty products. And I know, I know both of you, I think, I know Stephanie, you saw it. Sandy! Hello! I was kind of kidding about the Portillo's, but not really, and I thought I was going to text you. I, well, I was considering texting you later on that day, saying, like, I'm kind of kidding, but not really. I, I kind of want to bring over the, the Portillo's, and I, I just didn't, didn't end up doing it. <laughs> I owe you some Portillo's, love. So, some of you saw on Instagram that I uh, tried out um, Kel Williamson's speed tutorial on her, um, I'm using a lot of ums, I'm a little out of practice here, <sighs> Queen of Hearts tutorial, I don't know if any of you have seen that, but you should go check that out, we should go to the gym instead, yeah, I know you're right, but I want to figure out a way to say, no, we shouldn't, but, uh, I know you're right, <laughs> I'm not, uh, I'm not the physically fit kind. I spend a lot of time just doing this. Oh, okay. You know what? Hi, Eric. Welcome. Thank you so much for sharing. If you guys don't have Eric, check out Eric. He's an amazing supporter. Uh, where's Hazel? Um, Hazel eyed. Eric typically comes in with his love. They come together. And it's been a little while since I've been on, so I was going to do a quick get uh, get unready with me, and that's where I was. I was talking about the look I have on today on my eyes. This is from Kel Williamson's um, speed tutorial for Queen of Hearts. Hey, I got it out. J-Dog, welcome. Welcome. It's so good to see all of you. Thank you so much for coming in. Check each other out. I've got great people in here, and I'm, I'm glad I came on. I wasn't sure if I was going to do this, but I'm, I'm glad I did. So the first thing I'm going to do, and probably freak some of you out, but to my um, beauty lovers, I know it won't. So I'm just going to remove my, my lashes. I have some fake lashes on. I don't know if you can see them. And uh, they come off pretty easily, so I'm just going to take these off. These are the Adele, uh, is that what they're called? Ardell. Ardell 110s. Black. In life, these look great, but for on camera, they don't they don't look like I'm wearing anything. So, and then the, the first step in my clearing off the... It, you know, I actually don't feel them. Um, if they're on right, if they're the right length, I found if they're too long, if you don't trim them, then they bug you. They will bug you. But if they're on right, I don't, I don't even notice that they're there. So I'm going to go in with the Brulees by Alali. This is a, how do I explain it? It's kind of a solid texture. Yeah, the band is really small. 
It's really thin, really small. They're very light. Isn't this great? Yeah, and it does smell like date nut. It smells exactly like date nut. And as you can see, this is pretty well well loved, right? So it's kind of a, it's kind of a solid. How would you describe this? I think of it like chapstick. Um, it almost feels like a chapstick consistency and it doesn't take much. So when you pull it out of there, you just warm it up on your fingers and it turns into kind of an oily moisturizing. It's, it's a viscous liquid, right? So it's, it's a bit of an oil. And then I just press this onto my eyeballs and I let it sit for a minute and it'll dissolve everything. I had a dark black look on yesterday. I should have filmed that. I did a very sultry eye uh, that I followed Gab and Glam. Yes, it, exactly. It just melts. It melts it right off. Uh, I love this stuff. Mander, she made it. Hi, Manders. Thank you for coming in. I know you know Sandy. I think J-Dog is still here. I don't know if you know J-Dog and Eric. Eric Garcia might still be here. I don't know if they left when I pulled off the lashes. That might have been too much. If they're still in here, you should grab them and check them out. They're great supporters. Really great people. I'm loving those that... Sylvia, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I am doing a quick, quick. As you can see, it's melting, right? I'm looking beautiful, right? Uh, I'm doing a, a get unready with me using some Lolly beauty products. And I don't know if you guys have heard of Lolly. I'm loving this brand because it's exactly in my no by year replacement allowance. So it's living organic loving ingredients. Or maybe it's the other way. Loving organic living ingredients. And they upcycle food. So they, they take food waste like the nuts. Uh, the nuts from different foods, they upcycle it, they extract the oils, and they turn it into gorgeous skincare that they sell in glass packaging. There's no plastic. Uh, everything is organic, cruelty-free, all of that stuff. No parabens, no sulfates, and I'm, I've been loving, loving, loving their products. So I used a bit of the Date Nut Brulee to melt off my my eyeshadow, and as you can see, it, it, did, a, it did a nice job of it. So I'll take a little bit more and just touch the rest of my things because it really does just melt everything off. I'm glad you're liking it, Amy. <clears throat> it's always scary when you send someone something that you're like, this is my holy grail product. I love this. Irish whiskey. Hello. Welcome. We're doing a get unready with me with some lolly beauty products. Lolly cares about the environment. So the um, CEO and founder of Lolly used to work at a very big beauty company, very big. Everyone has purchased something from this company and she was tired of the waste that she was seeing. And so she went off uh, on her own and uh, you're putting on makeup for a video. So you, are you filming? <laughs> Sandy, are you filming while you're chatting with us? That is like holy rock star status. Um, so she went off on her own and started up Lolly. And she upcycles food, doesn't use plastic. It's minimal plastic. The um, caps, the black caps, this is plastic, but the... The bottles, everything that she sends you is food grade. Everything is food grade, like we can eat these products. And the bottles are food grade, so once you're done with them, you can turn them, in, you can recycle them, use them for food. This one's got a little topper on it, so it's perfect for like turning into a oil dispenser for cooking or vinaigrette, if you're making your own vinaigrettes. So after I kind of rub this um, date nut brulee, on my face to just melt. This is like my first step. This is the oil cleanser. Some people do two steps right with an oil cleanser and then uh, followed up with a soap cleanser. This this is Lawrence's World. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Check each other out. I've got great channels in here. Network, network the right way. Please do not use the word sub, subscribe, anything like that in here. Just check each other out quietly. If you do it right, 
Sylvia, you're a rock star. I love Confidence Plus. I love her. She's awesome. You use the Tatcha oil. So I, I've never tried that, Sandy. Um, so I'm going to now take a cloth and some warm water and I'm going to just wipe my face down because this should have all been melted, melted decently off. And I'm playing with this ring light, so I don't know if you guys have seen too on Instagram that I keep complaining about pictures. I bought this ring light because it's like, you're supposed to have the most awesome pictures. I got Natoma on PC and you on my phone. Ooh, nope. And your face on the camera. All right, all right, all right. Sandy A7. I owe you a, a B for something. That's that's freaking phenomenal. Yeah, I can't I can't even hold a conversation with two people here. Mari, welcome. It's so good to see you. I'm so glad that you came in. Thank you, thank you. All are you feeling better? I know that you said you weren't feeling so great. <laughs> Manders is in here. Sandy's in here. Well, so if we do the beef in a cup, right? If we do the beef in a cup, we're good. It's a little salty, but... Uh, okay, Mari. I hope they figure out what's wrong. I really do. It sucks that you're not feeling 100%. <clears throat> So I'm using this ring light. I was on that path. We should make it a drinking game. Actually, we should make it a drinking water game so that everybody gets their water in. Uh, every time I have a squirrel moment, take a drink, you will be well hydrated. Well hydrated. No dehydrated fans here. So I have this ring light and I've been struggling with pictures. I've been just trying to catch, capture a picture of my makeup looks. Mind Garden, hello! And uh, I love you. Thank you so much for coming in. And the ads on this ring light were that, you know, this is supposed to help you take amazing pictures and have fantastic video quality. So I haven't really been feeling good lately. I've been feeling... Lawrence, I'm sorry to hear. Maybe you're just detoxing. Sometimes when you change that, you're drinking grapefruit water. I saw someone else was drinking a Pepsi. Sylvia. Sylvia is drinking Pepsi keep you going uh, and this ring light so here I mean I can I can change I can go all the way down to nothing and then we can have like I mean check check that out like do I look heavenly because I can barely even see the screen with this turned all the way up um, this this ring light is brighter than my future so they say that this ring light is yeah detoxing Lawrence's world And um, they say that this was supposed to help with pictures. So I've been trying to take pictures of the looks that I do. Because I, in the mornings, uh, one of my guilty pleasures is I wake up every morning. I get a cup of coffee and I come and I watch my friends on YouTube. And I try to dupe their looks. Um, I try to dupe the tutorials that I see. I run a ton of videos. You'll see that I'm like leaving at least little hearts or something to say that that I was in there and uh, I want to film I want to take pictures of the looks because some of them turn out really great like in my makeup mirror which is right behind the camera so if it looks like I'm looking past the camera it's because I'm looking at the mirror and uh, they in my mirror it looks spot-on but then just trying to take a, a, a picture of it yeah it doesn't I, I not once have I gotten the picture to look right I love it too. I love it too. Uh, I, I'm really enjoying YouTube. So this is, it typically does not take me this long to wipe off the date nut brulee. <laughs> typically it is, <laughs> I, I take, and you saw what a smidgen it was. I mean, it was just the tiniest little, uh, use your phone with the back. Okay, Sandy, so that might be a problem because I am using it with the front, front mirror, um, front camera front-facing camera. I don't newer, I think it's called newer Mari. 
Um, <clears throat> and you can tell how well my makeup covered because I have a little sore here from tissues that, uh, well, these are advertised as being facial tissues. They're really sandpaper. So it was really, I mean, the tiniest bit, right? Like this, this is literally how much of the product I use on my whole face. So it's, it's literally the tiniest little bit of product. And then I wipe it off with a uh, warm water and a cloth that has now has makeup on it. <clears throat> I love the ice cream thing. Love it. Hopefully that'll settle things down, give you a sugar rush. So then the next thing I follow up with, and um, my pads are used, well used. They're not dirty, they're just used. These have all come through to wash. I have two kinds actually. Uh, I have these microfiber ones, reusable ones, and then I have some hemp ones. And I like the hemp ones. I can't seem to find one, here's one. I have little, little hemp rounds. And so I will take the, I'm almost, let me kill this bottle off. Moose Tracks. Oh my gosh, I haven't heard of that ice cream in probably a decade. So I have a little bit left here of the chamomile cleansing waters. Very little. And then I have a brand new bottle. So let's see if I can use this up. So then I use this over my face to take off any residual makeup. And uh, Amy, I think you got this in your little bag too, right? My chat went away. Don't go away. There we go. Loose tracks. Vanilla with some chocolate swirl. Mari is having. Mander's peach cobbler. Peach cobbler ice cream. Amy Cat had Ben and Jerry's. Thank you, Lawrence, for the compliment. So uh, I put a little bit of the cleansing waters on here and then I just go over it, my face again, and it takes off the residual. So it's like a, definitely like a dessert. Apple crumble, but with peaches. That sounds amazing. Did you make it? Did you make it yourself? I know that you were busy running all over today and getting some errands done. wonder if you fit in making a dessert as well. So this is what the bottle looks like new, the waters. As you can see, it's, um, it's actually two oils. They say that they send everything without, unsweet is still here. Upward is against the pores. Oh, and I pull, yeah, I do everything wrong. You're going to see me do every, every mistake that they tell you not to do, I do it. Everyone. So I put my face down. I when I put on my liner, I pull my eyes out. Everyone, I do. I I break all the rules. So this is what it looks like when the bottle's full. It's actually two different emollient. Uh, two different. Well, it's supposed to be like. They say that they ship water free, and I know that this is called the waters, but it actually has a bit of an oily, oily feel to it. But my skin just drinks it up. And then once I've done that, I don't know if you can see, do you want to see? Do you want to see what the cotton pad looks like after I've done the... Anthony, welcome. We're doing a bit of a get unready with me with uh, some organic products made from Lolly Beauty. They upcycle foods and don't use plastic in their packaging or at least single use plastic. And then everything is food grade, including the little glass things that they sell their products in and you can reuse these for foods. That's what we're up to. We're, I'm truly blessed and doing great. There's some amazing channels in here. Please check each other out. Okay, so upwards. I'm, gonna, I'm always gonna do this wrong, every time. Every time. So you mean that this brow that I keep, that my brow drops a little bit. I don't know if all of you have Amy uh, living in Chrysalis, if you ever watch her. <laughs> She has one side that, that her brow is down a little bit. I have that with this side too. This is the side that I sleep on, but it could also be my makeup removing tips. 
so it's actually the the brulee did this is pink to begin with but the brulee did a nice job like there's not much left here for the for the chamomile to take off and then because i'm extra bougie i have been loving this blue corn flower extract that they sell they put this for um i love your tricks stephanie i can't when you sat on the couch and did a full face of makeup, like with the tiniest mirror, I was blown away. I cannot do that. I wish you could see the setup behind me. I have a mirror with 10 times magnification. I've got a 100 watt bulb above me. My makeup mirror has a bulb in it too. Like I need light and stable surfaces and to be able to pull the mirror like right up to my face and to do that and you were calmly sitting there on your couch putting on your makeup i was blown away and it turned out beautiful <clears throat> so i'm going to use a little blue cornflower i'm using this up as well maybe maybe yeah so i use this as a toner sandy me too i need like the biggest mirror and then it has to be like 10 times magnification <laughs> Uh, I don't have glasses, but for some reason I can't see well enough to do my, my makeup. Uh, so I just use this as a toner, This and now I killed it. Uh, this is called Tone. My Manders, my mirror plugs in, so there's no way that I can lose it. Uh, you have one very similar. It's behind you. Uh, Manders is behind you in your setup, your silver mirror that kind of flips. Uh, Sylvia, I'm so glad you're still here. <laughs> big mirrors, <laughs> big mirror club, big mirror member right here. And mine I can't lose because it's plugged in. It's, it, it cannot, it can't leave my makeup desk. So Sylvia, do you have a channel? Do you post? Do, oh, I'm going the wrong way again. I'm going to break every rule. Uh, Sylvia, do you post? Do you have a channel? Do you do? Do you? My goodness. Happy Monday. Do you create videos? <laughs> Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, a bunch of us in here know each other pretty well. We've, we've been together for a few months now on YouTube. Thank you for the thumbs up. And uh, no, you just stalk. Bring on the stalking. I love the stalkers. Yeah, happy Monday. And uh, Sandy A7 and hello, Amy Cat. They both do um, unboxing. Sandy A7 also does makeup reviews. Amy does a little bit. Amy is hello, Amy Cat. Uh, lovely, lovely ladies. You should check them out if you like those kind of beauty channels. And then Mind Garden does a lot of tours. She's in Philadelphia and she's got some gorgeous footage. Gorgeous, gorgeous footage of street views of interiors of buildings i love it she walks around philadelphia at least her newer videos are of philadelphia and shows you everything in the area and it's incredible manders beauties does unboxings and beauty reviews and makeup tutorials and live chats and hangouts as well drink <laughs> well hydrated i promised i promised every no one would leave my chat dehydrated not one no dehydrated soul left behind. Come on in, let's have some water every time I have a squirrel moment. All right, so now that uh, I have toned, <clears throat> and this took off a little bit, uh, there's still a little bit, but I can't tell because my I reuse these and reuse these, so, uh, and they're stained. They Some of the makeup is stained on these. So after I've toned, I will go in with, I have all sorts of fun things here. I'm not sure which one to use first. I like, as a red wine, I am, I just had, it was the cupcake, it was by Cupcake, and it was some sort of a blend. I'm not a huge wine aficionado in the slightest. Um... Okay, give me the names of red wines because it's not coming to my brain. It's not a Pinot Noir. Those are really like uh, tan tannins. Is that the right word? Those have a bite in the back of the, the throat, right? 
layer cake wine. I've seen them, but I've never I've never purchased one, Amy. Uh, oh, Sylvia too. If you saw um, Unsweet Tea popping up, she does all sorts of unboxings too, and she's more focused on um, sustainable beauty. And she actually does not just beauty boxes, but all kinds of subscription boxes, including home things and. Um, Stationary, squirrel, take a drink. Okay, so, okay, yes, dry. Pinot Noir is very dry. This one that I had is not dry, and I cannot, it's a red. It's a red blend. I want to say it starts with an M, but I don't know if that's right. No, it's not Cabernet, but I do know that one. I'm gonna, I'm looking for a different, sorry, am I getting right up in there? Uh, it's not Merlot, it's a, there's a blend, a red blend. That's it, Malbec. <laughs> Amy for the win, Malbec. I have um, a Malbec that I really like from Cupcake Wines. That, that's as red as I go. So I have a little bit of prickly pear seed oil here. Yes, you do. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. And I'll take a drink of water because nobody's leaving here dehydrated. I'm going to use a little bit of their prickly pear. It doesn't, why doesn't it want to focus? Yeah. Uh, prickly pear seed oil that's supposed to be good for plumping. And when I use the products, it's, it's, the, it's literally like, that's it. It's like three drops. Moscato. That's a white sweet wine, right? Did I get that one right? And then I warm it up on my hands, the oils, and then I just kind of press. And this this time I do, whenever I'm putting these on, I do kind of push up, push up my face. I think all the guys left. We had a couple of guys come in. I think we scared them, scared them all away with the beauty. And then I follow that up with some seed buckthorn seed oil. So this is supposed to be good for, um, well, blemish, blemishes, although this is like straight up sand, sanded. Uh, I use some tissues that, well, I used a product. Let's, let's do it this way. I used a product that shows itself to be a facial tissue, but it's, it's sandpaper. We could, we could use these to take paint off of a wooden surface. Um, and that's what this is from. But the seed buckhorn, buckthorn seed oil is supposed to help with like rosacea. As you can see, I have some red spots and acne blemishes. I wish I just did my routine while I watched you. I wish someone was live every night at this time. That's adorable. Thank you. Mind Garden says I used to white wine. There we go. But progressed to red as I got older and now okay so you like the Pinot Grigio as well for the so you like the very dry yes isn't this great and sweet tea take a drink everyone I just had a squirrel moment you really like those dry wines that kind of bite bite in the back of your jaw huh like the ones that I can almost taste it thinking about it that they they grab you back here so with this again it is literally like uh, three drop, like the littlest amount. Uh, and again, I warm it up in my hands. Dry. So Amy is in Tennessee and um, Mind Garden is in, who? yeah, I passed high school geography. Philadelphia is in, let's see here. Philadelphia is in, is that Pennsylvania? Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania. I got Pennsylvania right. Go me. Uh, I deserve that, that high school diploma. I think you two would have fun together if you could get together and enjoy some wines. I know, right? Thank you. Bring on the praise. <laughs> I don't know if I passed the exam I took. Uh, Rose hip. I've heard so many good things about rose hip oil. Unsweet tea, Stephanie. Unsweet tea. Um, I've never tried it. 
Oh, you're going to go to sleep now? All right, well, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it, Manders. I'm actually moving on to my last step. I use the Chia Carrot Brulee as kind of a sleeping mask. And I'm going to put this on and then my night skincare routine is complete with my Lolly products. And this smells so good. I wish you guys could smell this. I use this as a lip balm too. Uh, it has a, it's like a, it's almost like a, a peat, a, it doesn't taste like carrot. I taste, taste more peach, even though I don't think it has any peach in it. It tastes peach, peachy to me. I love this stuff. And again, with the same, you can see, right, it's, you don't, I, I've had this for, it's so good. Um, I love this. And it, the same with, it's like a jelly consistency. Hi, Edward. Welcome. We're, uh, I'm doing a get unready with me. I just took off all my makeup and I'm using Lolly products, which you can't see. Oh, I, did I turn, did I turn that down up? Does that make it there? Maybe not. You can see Lolly. Uh, Lolly products, which are living organic, loving ingredients, something like that. Sandy, thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. I'm just going to pop on this tiny little bit. This is all that I need. And again, I warm this up in my fingers and I use this as my sleeping mask. Thanks, Sandy, for hanging out while you were filming and editing and supporting others. I'm truly grateful. We'll have to talk about the gym thing. I need to do it, but it never happens. Mind Garden is great. You should check her out. Everyone in here is really lovely. I, I watch them all. And so I put this on, and it's not, I don't need anything super heavy, even though it's just that tiniest little bit. It actually, like, ex there's enough here to go down into my neck. Rock on. There's enough to go down into my neck. It covered my whole face, and uh, when I wake up in the morning, I feel very plump, plump and hydrated. So that was it, my friends. That was my get unready with me with Lolly products. I know Amy's tried it. Has anyone else in here tried it? Tried anything from Lolly? <clears throat> I've considered getting a jade roller. Uh, I don't have one. I've seen people really rave about them and that you keep it in the fridge too so it's nice and cool and then you push it up and it's supposed to help with like lymph lymphatic drainage as well, right? Lymphatic drainage, and uh, thank you, Mind Garden. I'm so grateful that you stopped in. I absolutely love you. Keep rocking on. Oh wait, before you go, Mind Garden, uh, did you? Are you doing the van thing? Are you? Are you moving on to the van life? You had talked about it, but I didn't. I haven't. I can't tell in your videos if you're doing that yet or not. Hopefully soon. Okay. All right. Yeah, these are, uh, Sylvia, these are very refreshing. I love these. My skin drinks them up. Um, I was a little worried the first time I tried the Chia Carrot Brulee that I would wake up and like my pillowcase would be all orange. <laughs> um, good night, my garden. Thank you. I was afraid that I would get orange everywhere and that I would wake up like super sticky because this is you can definitely tell that there are there's sugar in here. It is, it has a, a great taste. I don't think it's a, she added sugar to the recipe. I think it's just the ingredients they have. I don't really know what a chia is. I thought chia were like little, well, I've had chia seeds. It must be a fruit too, right? I'm not sure. Um, and this has like a, a slightly sweet taste. And I was afraid that I would wake up and my hair would be all stuck to my face and my pillowcase would, you know, I'd lift my head up off the pillowcase and like my, my skin would pull away, you know, uh, as it's stuck to the pillowcase. But that's not the, that's not the case with this. 
so I was pleasantly surprised to see. Well, I think I'm going to hang it up here and say goodbye to everyone. I appreciate you stopping in. And as you live the dream this week, I hope that you be the change that you want to see and rock on. Bye, Mr. DJ. Thank you, Amy. Good night, Sylvia. Thank you for hanging out.